Namaste fam, Wolfgore here, and welcome back to Dark Souls 1 Remastered. The Lady Waifu returns. It has been quite some time since we played Dark Souls 1 together, but I definitely did not want to give up on this game, on this playthrough, but Sekiro definitely threw a wrench into the gears, but now that I've got Sekiro out of my system for the most part, uh, not that I'm not still enjoying it, but I am very ready to jump back into Dark Souls 1 Remastered. So, we are going to try to pick back up where we left off. And I do believe, at this point, we have two options of where to go. I'm pretty sure we defeated the Four Kings last time. We should probably check our souls and see if we actually accomplished that or if I'm just making that up. I'm assuming there will be some sort of item in here that will reference that. No, there's not. Would it be under key items, though? Ah, yes, the soul of the four kings who fell to dark. Okay, so we have done the bed of chaos, and we have done the four kings. That means we need to go beat Seethe in the Duke's archives, and we need to go beat Gravelord Nido in the Tomb of the Giants. So, which one are we going to do today? Well, I think that the Duke's Archives just sounds like more fun, so we're gonna try and do that. And I am totally on Sekiro controls, so I'm gonna be fucking up a lot today, so you're just gonna have to bear with me, boo. Just gonna have to bear with me. Uh, do we have enough for a level up? No, that is costing 40,000 souls currently, my goodness. Um, but let's see if we can warp over to the Duke's Archives and uh, start to make some progression. I don't love the limited warp options. Let's see, Sunlight Altar, no. Anor Orlando is probably the closest then, I would imagine. So let's go over to Anor Orlando and run our way over to the Duke's Archives. And I've never done the Duke's Archives before, so I'm actually excited for this. Whereas I believe I did do Tomb of the Giants once, so this will be a fresh experience for me. And I've never fought Seethe the Scaleless, so I'm pretty excited. Blocking. Uh, it's going to be really weird not being able to parry everything in existence with L1s. I am really enjoying Sekiro, though. It's a good game. It's a very good game. Hey, what's up, Zovio? How are you, brother? Thank you for coming by the stream. You get a gold star for being first. How's your day going, brother? Oh, right. Stamina bars are a thing. Ah! That's going to take some getting used to as well. Hmm. Do I have the music turned off? No. Just seems really quiet for some reason. Maybe that's the ambiance for the Duke's archives. It's like a library. It has to be quiet. No music allowed. Wolf, can I see an Orlando, please? Uh, like you want me to go look at an Orlando? I, I suppose we can do that. We can go enjoy the sights for a moment. I mean, it's dark because I uh, I took out the busty the busty lady with a dagger. So I don't know how well we'll be able to see it, but sure. Cities do look beautiful at night. There it is, my friend, An Orlando. It, uh, it does shine better in the day. I'll, I'll give it that. Cities look pretty at night because of the lights, and there is a lack of lighting. Someone said it's like a remake. Somebody said it's like a remake? I mean, they remade Anor Londo in Dark Souls 3. I'm pretty sure. So there's definitely a, <laughs> a strong reference point there. Boop, 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 boop. 
But again, it would be able to, it would be clearer in the day. But I cannot make it daytime anymore. Um. So we already got this bonfire. I guess we just can't teleport to this one for whatever reason. God damn it. Stop using Estus flasks. Ooh. Huh. Sorry, I like made no sense, but somebody said it looked just like Dark Souls 3, just no snow. Is Dark Souls 1 good? Yeah, it's a great game. Um, I mean, obviously it's a little dated. It came out a long time ago. But I personally think, ow, I personally think it was the best of the Souls games. Even better than Dark Souls 3, which is, ow. Oh my god, it's so slow compared to Sekiro. Holy shit, I'm gonna die. Oh. Oh, oh, it's so slow. Fuck you. Stop it. Stop it. Okay. Oh my, that's just embarrassing. Wow. Oh, if I was playing Sekiro, I would have, I would have been totally fine there. I would have just, just run on through. No problems, no questions asked. But uh, this is going to take some adjusting. Hey, what's up, Maria? How are you, my dear? Thank you for being here. LMAO, when would you do Dark Souls 3 again, and why did you stop playing? Um, I stopped playing because, well, you know, I beat it. I beat it six or seven times. And, uh, I, you know, I'm a fan of Dark Souls 3, but it's not like... You know, it's not like a Bloodborne in my life where it's like I feel super connected to the game and I feel the, the urge to just keep playing it and revisiting it. Like, I, I'm sure I'll hop back into Dark Souls 3 again at some point, but I just don't really feel much of an urge to do that. Whereas Dark Souls 1, I have never completed. Ah! And I would really like to. Jesus, this is rough. I tell you what. Oh my god. Oof. <laughs> I'm trying to L1 spam to parry, and it's not working, obviously. Alright. Really gonna have to adjust to this pacing. Yeah! Okay, killing stuff. We're adjusting, we're adjusting. Ah! Oof. Ow. Doing okay, how are you? I am doing well, Maria. Just had a, a decent Monday. And uh, I am just ready to kick back, relax, and play me some Dark Souls. Ow. Oh my god, what was that? Ah, uh, okay, I thought there was a reason you stopped. No, not, not particularly. I just felt like the game ran its course. I mean, the appeal of getting a character up to maximum potential in Dark Souls 3 does sound kind of fun, but that's just... That's a lot of grind, that's a big process, and I just don't really feel up to it. I've got other games that I would rather play. It's a good game, though. It's a very good game. I'm a fan. Alright. I got it now. I'm warmed up. We're gonna do this. Where the... Fuck did you come from? Ah! Oh man. Hey, remember when I said the Duke's archives was gonna be fun? <laughs> Ow. Have at thee! Oh man. Alright. Oh, 
Fucking A! Stop it! Alright, 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 alright. We're chilling. Hey, what's up, Steph? How you doing, bro? Oh, sorry I missed some of the stream. I'm chilling in Erythiel. That's okay, dude. I've only been live for like 10 minutes. You are right on time, my friend. That's a little better. Hey, that staggers him. Fucking hell, mate! And now you just teleport away. Alright, cool. Cool. Bring it. Bring it on, you bitch. Yeah, you break that table. You break that table. You show it who's boss. Alright. Ah! Ah! Wrong button. Oh, God. Mistakes were made. Right, I really need to deal with this channeler, bitch. Alright, he dead. Oh my lord! They're everywhere. They're like locusts. Hmm. We gotta do it. We gotta kill him. Ah! Hey, backstabs for the win. Probably should have done that initially. But hey, you live, you learn. God, I keep holding square to try and auto loot everything like in Sekiro. And then I use an Estus flask. And then I feel stupid. We're gonna, we're gonna get out of that mindset, don't you worry. Alright. Soul of a brave warrior. Lovely. Mm -hmm. Sprint by holding O. Oh, yes, at least that's the same. <laughs> hmm. Alright, I feel like we have fully explored this room. I think. Probably not. I probably missed something, like that chest on top of that bookshelf over there. Bitch! Come at me. Alright, we've got an elevator there. Let's start exploring. I think I see a chest. Do -do 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 -do. Twinkling tight night, I'll take it. Erythiel is a scummy place like all the others, is it? My end keeps buffering. Oh, shit. Um, hmm. I hope that passes, my friend. Because everything looks fine on my end, but I don't know. And hey, what's up, Green King? How are you, brother? Thank you for coming by. Beer Bee Wolf. Gonna get MK11. All right. Ow. Ugh, stamina bars. Fuck you. Yeah. Stop it. Oh, jeez. <laughs> Keep trying to parry like I'm playing Sekiro. Oh, feels good, man. So I decided my career for a little while. Really, tell me more. What is your career? NG Bus, how are you, brother? Hey, Wolf, how's it going, brother? My brother? It's going great. Oh, that's a... That's a mimic. It's going great. Just a good old-fashioned Monday. Feel like I should have got grabbed there, but I'm glad I didn't. Nothing too crazy. Just did some electrical stuff. Put some wires in some walls and 
Yeah. Now I'm playing some Dark Souls, and I'm pretty happy about it. So how does one get that chest? Is there a break in the railing over there? I feel like there has to be. Perhaps you have to fall from higher up. Oh, there's a break in the railing up there. I see. And there was a side room over here, so let's go check that out. I'm good. I'm tired. I feel it, dude. Mondays. Am I right? Am I right? Only four more days to go. More twinkling titanite. Huh. This is an interesting view. A bit cloudy. But a lovely view nonetheless. I wonder if that's the undead bird down there. No, I'm tired of Game of Thrones giving me blue balls and nothing big happens. Bro, I know. The first two episodes, like... I'm not going to say they were bad by any means. Like, they were good episodes. They were very well done. But fucking, like, nothing has happened. It's all just build up. I can't wait for episode three. I was so mad when the episode ended last night. I was like, what the fuck? Nothing really happened. Just a bunch of people talked to each other. And Podrick sang a song that was really good, but... Ah! Partial parry. Ow. You gotta parry your ass. Fuck. Fuck! There it is. I decided I'm gonna be a porn star because today was terrible and I just want to be numb and get paid. <laughs> Well, you're certainly pretty enough to be a porn star. I believe in you. But maybe sleep on it before you hop into the porn industry. Just a little advice. But I, I trust your decision making. No judgment if you choose to get into the porn industry. Oh, hell yeah, next week. Oh, that battle is going to be so epic. I'm excited. I feel the love. Yeah. Oh! Oh! Um. You have to get killed by Seath, don't you? But Seath can curse you with his attacks. So I'm going to burn up as much of my own health as I possibly can. And hopefully I won't get cursed. I will just die. Ah, okay. Uh, I should put on a ring of sacrifice. Oh well. That would have been a good time to actually use one. I feel the love, haha. <laughs> You'll feel the love if you get into porn. <laughs> Got him. Was so happy about Brienne of Tarth. Oh, that was a great scene. The whole scene, Podrick's song, Brienne. Uh, spoiler alert. Five, four, three, two, one. Okay, Game of Thrones spoilers from this point on. <laughs> But yeah, Brienne getting knighted was fucking great. And I've really loved all the character interactions so far. They've been doing a great job of making it good, even though nothing's really happening. Like, epicness-wise. Fucking you little shits. What is happening? No, I am not trying to cast power within, lady. Jesus. Enough. Die. Heathen. Die! Yeah, it was great. Super great. And, uh, uh, what's his name? Um, Tor Torment Giant Bane? The Giant Bane guy who likes Brienne. Oh, their, their scene was so fun. I hope they get together. I ship them. Is shipping still a thing? Do people still do that? 
I'm going to get through this without taking damage. Yay, I'm going to stay with my job for a while till I move. Then when I'm established, I'll probably do it. Go for it, my friend. Keep me, keep me posted. Fucking hell. Oh, shit. Fucking fuck off, mate. Fuck off, mate. Crap. Will Power Within kill me? Yes. Now we know. Yes, like he said, he wants to make giant babies with Brienne. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I killed a giant when I was ten. Then I crawled into his wife's bed and she suckled me at his teat. That's how I got so strong. Giant's milk. <laughs> Just pouring fucking giant's milk down his chin. It was so fucking funny. Ah! Right. Fuck off! God damn, you're annoying. That jump attack, though. Eh. So I talked about it with my brother and said it would scar him from porn forever. So now it's my goal. <laughs> yeah, scarring family members is always fun. True story. Boy, prick. Give me that key. So how was everybody's Easter weekend? Um, I spent it like I spend all weekends. I live streamed Friday, Saturday. And then Sunday I had girls day and hung out with my roommates. And it was lovely. But I'm not really a fan of Easter as a holiday. Like aesthetically, I hate the colors. Like the baby blue and pink and green and and then the the springtime, ugh, just the whole thing. I'm just like, ugh, worst holiday ever. I'm glad it's over. Now I just gotta close my eyes and goose frau ball my way to fall. All right, got to fight some snake lads. Where are you going? All right. Where the fuck are you going? What's this? What's happening? Yo, I never thought about it. Must suck if you have siblings working in porn. Yeah. Oh man, it's like playing Russian roulette. You never know when the bad one's gonna come. <laughs> come. The fuck out of my way, snake boy. Yeah. That's what I thought. It's locked. All right. So that's how we get out, I would assume. I wonder if porn stars watch their own pornos. Hmm. Food for thought. Whoa. Whoa. All right, easy enough. Any goodies in here? No. No. It's locked. More Cthulhu's are coming. Ah, oh, shit. Probably could have timed that better. Here 
Here we are. Ah! Yeah! Gotta say, the Boreal Valley has become my favorite location in terms of appearance. Oh, yeah, I love the Boreal Valley. It's fucking gorgeously designed. Easily one of my favorite zones. Right up there with, uh... Uh, up, up, uh, the Snowy Zone and Bloodborne. Why the hell can't I think of the name? I've been there a million times. You know the one. Kanehurst Castle, that's the one. Whoa, you got hops. Uh, the enemies can eat my ass, though. Yeah, the enemies are rough, but the zone is lovely. Quite lovely. Well, I'd say porn stars do watch their own videos just as actors watch their own clips. Yeah. But I mean, like, do they watch it for, like, the sake of watching porn, if you know what I mean? Or are they just watching it to, like, improve their game? Don't you googe at me. Alright, I think if we go up here, we can turn off that music thing. Make our lives a little bit easier. Hello? Ow! You fucking cuck. Shit. Shit! Oh, bollocks. It's a bit more than I bargained for. Woo! Fuck off. Fuck off. Are you serious? Oh, man. Stun locked for days. Feels bad. So one of my vids on YouTube has 10,000 views. Dude, that is awesome. Congratulations. I fully understand how awesome that feels. I remember my first video that hit 10k. <sighs> Good times. Good times. Yeah, which video? Tell us more. How to quilt... Oh, how to quit the legendary way at Walmart. <laughs> Ooh, well, that sounds fun. What's a legendary way to quit? Is this from personal experience or the story of a friend or tell us more skirtly perp did you actually like walk out of Walmart and quit in a while making a video because that's fucking savage yeah that's better. Ah. Thanks for lining up for me, love. Way cooler, bro. Ooh. I'm sensing a good story here. Neato. Got a key. All right. So if I pull this, uh, it turns it on. I don't, I don't think I want it on. I think I want it off. There we are. Hmm. Got to kill these squids again. Ah! relatively easy at least nope <gasps> it's the time traveler himself big hat Logan oh 
I'm sorry. I'm gonna put you out of your misery. I don't feel good about this. Oh, I can backstab you fancy. Miracle, bountiful sunlight, and soothing sunlight. It's locked. Shit. Hello again. What a chance meeting this is. Is Alas, it? Yes, I'm imprisoned once again. I don't suppose you could stage me again. The archives. Such a storehouse of knowledge. So close, but just out of reach. The thought offends me, so I could simply die. As a student of the arts, you understand me. Yeah? Mm. Where do I get the key? Hello again. Hmm. All right. Hmm. Come on. Hey. Hey. Jump master extraordinaire. I don't think there's anything up here. I could have sworn there was an item up here, but eh. yeah. That ah, fuck off. All right. So what do we do now? Can't get out, Big Hat Logan. Oh, but I did get a key, so we can probably leave the zone. I'll probably have to look up later how to, uh... Where's Zombie? I need Zombie Nugget. He he'd know how to unlock Big Hat Logan. I'm almost tempted to hit him up on the Discord. <laughs> zombie! I need your information, sir. Can we open this now? Yes! Lovely. Large soul, sure. And there's an item over there. I would like to get that. Ow! Fuck off! So if we come around back here, oh bollocks! Forgot about these idiots. Yeah. That wasn't too bad. Nice. Ouch. Also, have a lot, a total of 30,000 views on my channel. Not as many subs, sadly. Oh, I understand. I've been doing the math a little bit lately, and I find that about every 200 views, roughly, I get, not counting views from current subscribers, but from new subscribers, roughly 1 in 200 leads to a new subscription. Which isn't bad. How many subs are you at? I wasn't even paying attention. I don't even know what item I just got. It's probably just a soul or something. Alright, well, other than Big Hat Logan, I feel like we've done everything here. Are we sure we don't have his key? No, it's definitely locked. Strange. 184? Nice, dude. You're you're well on your way to 1,000. That's pretty good still. I agree. For better or worse, there are no shortcuts on YouTube. You gotta gain them one at a time. Unless you do sub-trading, which I would definitely not recommend doing. Alright, 
Let's try and get out of here. Can come back for Logan later. Oh shit. Oh shit. Rude. Come down here. Fight me like a man. Ow! Ow! Fuck. Oh god. No! Not like this! God damn it. Ugh. The recovery is so slow. Uh, feels bad. I'm quitting for a while to work on music and relax. I've been really stressed lately, so... Okay, okay. Uh, do you mean quitting YouTube or... Uh, your other work? Ow. Fuck off. YouTube, gotcha, gotcha. Yeah, sometimes you need to take a break. I've taken breaks myself. Sometimes it's just what you gotta do. Your channel will always be there whenever you're ready to come back. Hmm. Alright, let's try and get out of here. Oh. Oh, there's something hidden over there. Let's go get that. What is this? We oh, fuck you. Really? Ah, oh, Dark Souls. Wise words, Wolf. Can't agree more. Well, thank you. I try. <laughs> I should probably... No, actually, snake dudes aren't moving. That's just fine. Gives me D's. Alright, maybe I should jump? Or roll, at least? Fuck! Fuck! Bollocks. So I keep bumping into a ledge. I need to avoid that. But how? How? Hmm. This item better be worth it. Work tomorrow, which sucks. But I've been going from work for a week. But I've been gone from work for a week, so I guess it's time to work hard. Yeah. Yeah, definitely. Don't want to disconnect with work entirely. It's good for the mind, good for the body. Oh. The maiden set and the white seance ring. Fancy. Probably won't be using that, but nice to know that we got it. I wonder why it's here. I wonder what the lore implications are. Who knows? Alright, finally, let's move on from this room. Expected nothing less. Fuck off, mate. Skeet, skeet. Are you an archer? Of course you are. Of course you are. Shit. Hmm. Ah, 
I'm back in here. Ah! Alright. Another one of these fuckheads. Oh, hello. Multiple fuckheads. Uh huh. Ow! Fucking leg loss over here. Dealt with. Handled. Alright. So... Fuck! Off! How did I not see you? Fuck off! Alright, how do I take care of this coont? Some sort of mechanism needs to be moved. Is it over here? No. Couldn't be that simple. Well, sadly, I must go because work. It was good seeing you, Wolf. Hell yeah, Green King. Thank you for chilling, brother. I'll see you next time, alright? Good luck at work tomorrow. Hmm. No. What does this do? Fuck off. About to pay for that, son. Are you an archer? Of course you're an archer. What else would you be? see what's all the way over this way and we can always turn the staircase around see if that has any impact there's the channeler fuck off fuck off all right you know I've killed a lot of those crystal dudes and I don't think any of them have dropped anything not that it matters. Just seems unusual. Whoa. Alright. So I can finally get to him. Should probably heal. Shit. Bitch. No! <sighs> of course I missed. Ah, uh, motherfucker. Shit. 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 <laughs> Die. All right. So I feel like we've explored this side of the room. Hmm. But this opens up this. So we should look around, yeah? Hmm. How am 
I supposed to kill you? <gasps> Quint. Alright. That puts us in a bit of a predicament. Shit. Feels bad, man. Feels bad. Wonder where everyone is at. Oh, it's just. It's a Monday, which is a slow stream day, and it's Dark Souls, which is a slow stream game. Pretty standard. Although I would expect Zombie to be here. He hasn't missed a Dark Souls stream yet. The Zombie Hollows of Dark Souls 3 are so annoying. Yes, yes, they are. Rip. Ripperoni and cheese. Come hither, bitch. Woo. Mm. Oh, God. Hello. No, hmm. oh, these fuckers are back. Come fucking land the second attack. What is the problem? Every time. All right. Oh, jeez. Yeah, you do your stupid dance. You're about to die. Might as well die dancing, you bitch. Shit. Shit. Well, there it goes. 40,000 souls. Feels bad, man. Bollocks. Duke's archives is rough. Mm hmm. Mm. Alright. Third time's the charm. Oh, look at that big crystal structure out there. That's where Seed lives. Interesting. Whoa. Oh. Your arrows are very slow. Whoa, what the fuck? My max health was cut in half. Uh, are you in a cursed dungeon? Because that'll happen. Or in co-op, that'll happen. Those are the only two instances I can think of where your health gets cut in half. Fucking land the second hit! What in the hell is wrong with me? Can't land that second hit to save my life. Woo! Caught it. Fuck you. All right. Arrows. So if I turn this around, yeah, 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 and we go up here, we're back to where we were, almost. 
Damn, someone donated you $160, Wolf. Wow, good job. Yeah, it was a Green King on the New Game Plus 100 Harry Potter build of Bloodborne. He just went crazy. And it's freaking awesome. Still haven't spent it, though. Nice to have a little money in the PayPal account. Can't lie. Yeah, ironically, right before he donated, we were actually talking about your donation. Because I was like, hey, is it, like, in bad taste to have one of those up there that, like, keeps track of donations and stuff? Because Jeebus donated very generously. And then everybody was like, no, it's not in bad taste. It's like a cool shout out. And I was like, okay, cool, let's do it. And then all of a sudden, Green King starts dumping money into the channel. And I was like, holy shit, bruh. This is awesome. There we go. I'm not sure why that was so hard. So if it were not for Green King, your name would be up there. Sorry about that. Hmm. Alright, nothing much over there. But if we turn this around. Did I already explore this? Yeah, I did already explore this, right. So we can come over here now. <laughs> Happy for you, Wolf, but now I'm jelly because wood wood been up there, lol, but it's all good. You deserve it. Thank you, bro. Yeah, it was unfortunate timing. I should have just put the board up there. But, uh, you know, in the end, I got... That was a really good month. Thanks to you and Green King and Batucius, I made like $250 that month on Twitch, which is a lot <laughs> more than anything else I've ever made, so I'm certainly not going to complain. Hello, hello. What have we got here? A blue Titanite chunk. Fancy. Hello. How's work been, Wolf? Uh, it's been good. Crystal Ember, cool. Um, I'm actually very satisfied with being an electrician. It's... Oh, fuck. It's going well for me. I'm enjoying it. And I'm learning a lot, and I feel like there's good potential in my future. Um, the only downside is that it is now spring and summer is on the way and being an electrician in the summer fucking sucks because you are generally most of the time not working in air conditioning lots of people like to do new construction during the spring and summer months because it's a good time to do it so unless I'm on a service call I'm in the heat but it's alright, I'll get used to it. I tell myself now, I won't. I'll be miserable all summer. <laughs> Prism stones times 20, okay. Interesting. Hey, one of those crystal dudes dropped something. A caduceus night shield, fancy. The heat, yes, I totally understand, Wolf. Yeah. Tis a bitch. But we shall survive. 
I believe in us. Oh, how'd I miss you? Oh. The dancing set. Fancy. So this is back at the start of the zone? He says with a question mark in his voice, No, this is different. Um, I think... I'm pretty sure this is a bonfire that you can teleport to, which makes me want to consider kindling it. What does my humanity situation look like? Lots. Plenty. Okay, let's just go ahead and do it. Um, how do you... Right, like that. How's work been for you, though, my dude? Anything new? I know, last time we talked about your work, you were thinking about wanting to do something else. Any leads? Any ideas? Kindle. All right, twenty Estus. We're in a good place. Let's see what else this zone has to offer. Oh, and there was that chest back at the beginning on the bookshelf that we never got. Ah! Ah! Fuck! Let it go. I'm just gonna go rest. Not worth it. Bad start. I don't know what the hell the brand welding thing is in the dungeon are called, but they're fucking terrifying. Oh, yeah. The ones that just take your health away by, like, looking at you? Yeah, they're fucking horrible. Floating book! Magic confirmed. This is Hogwarts. Hmm. Come here. Bitch. <laughs> Coming for you, arrow boy. Woo! There you are. How the hell am I supposed to get to you? Son of a biscuit. No, no ideas yet. I kind of want to take, like, a placement test to see what would be the best career for my skills and personality. That's not a bad idea. It's not a bad idea at all. I've never taken one, but, you know, just having some more information. Having more information makes every situation better. But, failing that, you can always become an electrician. I would recommend it as a career path. Good work, plenty of need for it, and it pays well. Minor risk of dying to electrocution, but, you know, we don't talk about that. <sighs> I can confirm that getting shocked through the chest with 110 is very unpleasant. Not that that needs confirming, but, you know. Uh, 
so we've been here before, yeah? Yeah, 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 yeah. Fuck off. So I feel like... Huh. There's a lot of layers to this place. Alright, we did miss a chest, but I don't really feel compelled to go get it. I think we've got enough things and stuff. Let's move on. When we come back to do, uh... To free Big Hat Logan, we can grab the chest then. Yes, my friend said he can get me a job with his brother-in-law as an electrician. Ooh, having an inn really helps. If you can jump straight into it, that's a very, very good thing. Because otherwise, you gotta, like, start going to school and get an apprenticeship through the school, which is typically union, which is not necessarily something that you want. Not that there's anything wrong with the union, but, you know. If you can get in, it's a good thing. Uh, crystal boys. Hello. Alright. Sort of hoping for a 1v1 situation. Ew. Ah! The blue titanite chunk. I see you. Shit. Yeah. <laughs> Ow. You juked me with the double hit. It's all right. Ooh. It's a lot of crystal boys. Yeah. Yeah. More blue chunks. Hmm. Ooh. Just one. Just one. Just one. Jesus fucking Christ, come on. Oh, thank you. Appreciate your cooperation, sir. It's really quite polite. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, these crystal golems are all right. Woo Shit. Fucking hell, mate. God, the combat is so slow-paced. Like, I thought it was slow compared to Bloodborne, but after getting used to Sekiro, it's like... Glacial. Fucking glacial. Hey, I tried some mango chips. I don't know if they were like the ones that you had a while back. I like them because I like the pineapple chips more. Hell yeah, dude. Uh, the ones that I was eating, I don't think they were quite chips. They were still, like, chewy, and they were pretty thick. They were just, like, little dried chunks of mango. But, yeah, dude, I'm addicted to those. Sadly, I'm out right now. Because the store I buy them from was closed. When I went shopping on Easter. But that's rad. Pineapple chips sounds fucking good, too. I could get down with some pineapple chips. I just cut up a fresh pineapple yesterday. Mwah. 
Bellissimo. Maron. I don't even know what those words mean. I just assume they're positive. Hey, we got a set. Fancy. They were chewy too? Yum. That's where it's at. I'm all about that chewy life. You can keep your crunchy cookies. I want mine chewy and moist. Fuck. Yeah, invisible wall. Ah! Where'd you come from? Fuck! I accidentally scratched my nose. Now I'm bleeding. Oof. Oh, I hate that, Maria. That's the worst. Freaking noses. They're like faucets when you cut them. I used to have the worst problem with bloody noses when I was a kid. I'd just be like chilling. Fucking nothing going on. And all of a sudden, I'm just dripping blood out of my nose. I'm like, am I dying? Is this what dying looks like? Because I think, I think this is what dying looks like. But then they just stopped one day, and I'm happy about that. Got them at Whole Foods? Oh, you baller. Shopping at Whole Foods. Alright. Nothing left to do but explore this crystalline cavern. I've never done this before. I mean, I'd never done any of this before, but this is quite an iconic area, and I'm nervous. I'm a virgin. Don't. Some rather large butterflies here. What if you can kill those with like a bow and arrow or something? That'd be fun. How far do I step forward when I do this? Eh, not that far. <laughs> I poked it. Oh, did I make it mad? Oh, shit. <laughs> Mistakes were made. Ow, fuck, that hurts. Okay. Serious mistakes were made. Uh. Yep. Cool, that went well. Next time, I'm not going to boop the butterfly. Hmm. I'm coming for you, Seethe. Coming for your booty. fighting any of you fuckers. I've done it once. That's good enough for me. Same for you, fuckboy. My mustache is at that point where it's curling into my lip, but I haven't got it fully trained yet. So it's just constantly tickling my lips. And if you've ever had somebody rub a hair or something like that on your lip, 
you know how ticklish that can be. Ticklish isn't even the right word, it's like torture. Mm. Alright. 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 Ah. That wasn't so bad. So if I jump down there and get that item, can I not get back up? That's probably the case. Fuck it. I'm a completionist. Give it to me. Shiza. Ow! Stop it. Son of a bitch. Uh, frustration. Humiliation. Hey, do you put anything like balm for your beard and stash? I have a product called Urban Prince Beard Oil for my beard. Um, which is something that I use after like shampooing it uh, to keep it from getting dried out. And the hairs from getting damaged. And I have mustache wax for my mustache. I rarely use either, but it's pretty much like just after showering. But yeah. Yes, I do. I'd use them more, to be honest, but they're like super expensive. Like this tiny, tiny little jar of mustache wax. It's like about the size of a silver dollar and like maybe eight of them stacked on top of each other like it's a very small container it costs like thirty five dollars I'm like jeez but it smells so good and has a mustache on it so you know it's fancy I used to think facial hair was unattractive now I like it <laughs> oh I I'm gonna take credit for that <laughs> JK it's got to be done well, you know. A man who takes good care of his facial hair and makes it look nice. Just like a, a woman that takes, you know, good care of her hair. You know, it can be can be very attractive. Hey, what's up, Dark Dragon's Fury? How are you, friend? Thank you for coming to the stream. Right, I gotta go get my souls. I hate this new area. Ew. Ooh, a blue titanite chunk. I went through all that for that. It made me so annoyed when I played. Yeah. Yeah, I've been in this zone for like... I started the Duke Archive. I started the Duke's Archives like an hour 15 ago. It has been quite the challenge. And now I do not know if there's any way to get back up there. No, there is not. Man, what a useless item. All that for a blue titanite chunk. Shit. My souls are going to be down on that ledge. Which means the only way to get my souls back is what? To... Jump down on the ledge, grab my souls, homeward bone out, and then do the whole run again? Ugh. What a pain. Oof. Oof, indeed. This whole zone has been one massive oof. I mean, it's an attractive zone, I'll give it that, but... Oof. That's the only way? Alright. I'll probably do it. I want the souls. And I've got the time. But I won't be happy about it. You hear me, Miyazaki? Hear me?
Uh, don't attack the butterflies, by the way. They get mad. Alright, come over here. There's my souls. Huh. There's snow landing. Right here. It almost looks like there's another secret path, which would kind of make sense. Generally, in Soulsborne games, they don't put areas in the game that you can't walk out of. I think I'm actually going to try that. We're going to take a leap of faith. You see those little white, like, snowflake things landing there? That looks like a secret path. <gasps> I cracked the code. I did it, fam. Are you proud of me? Look at those puzzle-solving skills. I didn't get that from no video. I figured that out with my noggin. My noodle. Did I? Oh, my God. How am I so dumb? I could have sworn I grabbed my souls. This way's probably safer. Could have sworn I grabbed my souls. <gasps> Scary. I'm so proud. Thank you, Dark Dragons Fury. I appreciate you. Alright. I think we are all ready to go fight Seethe. Do I have a curse bite ring? No, oh, I have the Covenant of Artorias on. I certainly don't need that. I do have a Curse Bite Ring. Excellent. That should help. There, you're using <laughs> your old noodle skills. I try to dust them <gasps> off every once in a while. Keep the old noodle as sharp as possible. But at my age, it's, it's all downhill from here. Oh, clams. We gotta fight the clams. The clam clan. Gonna chop them, make, chop them up and make some clamato. Alright. Well, you get staggered at least. Ow. It's quite the stagger you do yourself. Stop it. All right, stun locking you is fairly simple. Twinkling Titanite, fancy. All right, let's just try and get one. Come here, love. Yeah. Skeet, skeet, skeet. Ooh, there's a lot of them. Fuck, I got two. It's about to go down, lads and lasses. <laughs> Dealt with. Handled. Huh, so you could farm Twinkling Titanite here. Fancy. More clammy friend. I like your little legs. They're adorable. Skeet skeet. All right, now it's time for seethe. So we need to go break the thing in the back, yeah?
I want to say you're a pretty dragon, but your lower half is kind of gross. You should get that looked at. It's a bit tentacly. Pardon. Oh, oh! I was on the right side all along. Yeah! Take that, bitch! Alright, start wailing on his gooch. Well, this is hard so far. Seethe. You missed. Seethe. You missed. <laughs> I feel like that fight could have used some more fine tuning, but alright. We got another Lord Soul. Neato Mosquito. Hey, forgot to ask this, but was your weirded out uh, was your weirded out at first about the sex scene in last night episodes? Yes, yes, absolutely I was. I was like, you are too fucking young to have a sex scene. Like, the actress may not be anymore. She might be, you know, past 18. But it definitely made me uncomfortable. I was like, nope. This does not feel right. You are still a child in my mind, and I do not want to watch you have sex. Made me very uncomfortable. Thank you for asking. Um, okay, so we're done here. We can level up. Endurance, vitality, strength. Let's keep putting points in strength. We have a fancy sword that requires 50 strength, and I would like to get to 50 and try that sword out. Get all the equipment all repaired. Whoa. Okay, totally. I rewatched the episode and I skipped that scene. You know, I don't blame you. I don't blame you. It was very, very strange. Not sure why they did that, but... At least it wasn't like... Full-on softcore porn, you know? It was like... More just implied sex... Which I was grateful for. Alright, let's warp out of here. Let's go to Firelink. Hmm. So where do we get the key to release Big Hat Logan? I don't know. Seems like GOT has a lot of lewd scenes. Yes, very much so. There's lots of tits, lots of ass. Is there dick in the show? I think there might even be dick in the show. It's it's pretty out there. It's like, whoa, that's, that's what's happening. Okay. Don't watch this with your kids. Um, 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 um. So we need to now... Descend into the Tomb of the Giants. Stone Dragon, the Abyss, Dark Moon Tomb, and Orlando. Crystal Cave. Uh, do any of these take us down there? Dark Moon Tomb? No, that's an in Orlando. The Abyss. Where's the Stone Dragon? Highly doubt that's where we need to go, but just out of curiosity. Oh, this place. I cut off your tail. Sorry. Alright, I guess we gotta go from Firelink then. Which is fine. Although, I don't know if I'm actually up for another zone. We made some good progress. 
we got the Duke's archives done. I think that's a fine little place to wrap it up for the day. Next time we'll do Tomb of the Giants. We'll kill Gra Gravelord Nito. And then we shall uh, keep going from there. Yeah, I think that's what we're going to call it for today, guys. Thank you all for chilling. Thank you for watching. I appreciate you. And uh, Dark Dragon's Fury, if you're still here, smash that follow button. Love to see you again, friend. Yeah, I've seen two sets of dicks in Game of Thrones. Hodor's and the actor who was playing Joffrey in the play. Oh, yeah. Yep, there's definitely dick in the show. <laughs> and on that note, <laughs> GG. Good night, Maria. Good night, Jeebus. I'll see you guys here uh, possibly tomorrow. If not, there will at least be a video upload on the YouTube. So there's that. All right. See you all next time. Bye-bye.